Eli Lasso, hi, welcome to SpeedKick. Uh, just a few questions. So tell us, uh, what was your musical inspiration as a child? Well, I had many different uh, inspirations, but especially the, the band Irake uh, from the master Chucho, uh, Chucho Artes. Yeah. That was one of my biggest inspirations. And, and of course, uh, in, in the drums, uh, there was people like Tata Wines and and guy that that took me to do what, what I do. You have a favorite conguero? Tata Winners. Tata Winners. No question. No question. Yeah. Uh, are you a lot on tour? So tell us, give us advice how to survive touring. Touring. Well, touring. It depends on many things. If you could can survive or not survive. <laughs> but try to eat healthy. Uh, because in the in, on tours you eat a lot of garbage yeah. all the time, so uh, that that would be a, a good suggestion. Try you, to eat healthy. Are you warming up before every concert? How? I warm a little bit, uh, stretching my hands and arms, and my neck, and try to start s slow. Try to not uh, give give it all from the beginning. You yeah. know, try to. Take it, easy. It, take it easy and build, build things up. What is your favorite record? I have many different favorite uh, records that I really like. Um, but uh, I will... Descarga uh, Cachao... No, uh, I think the name, I can't remember the name, but it was a, it was a record together with Cachao, Tata Wines, uh, I think it's called Descarga... I can't remember the name. But it's one, this is one of my, of my favorites, and, and the one that the live recording from Irakere in the 79, I think it was, the, they got the Grammy. Yeah. I'm bad with names, but uh, I have many different... Is there a kind of music scale you don't like? In my case, as a percussionist, uh, it's difficult to say that I don't like a type of music, because I always try to make my percussion to fit with all kinds of, of, of music. No? And, I am very open. I have a big spectrum of music that I like, so I, it's difficult for me to say that it's yeah. something I don't like. Yeah. Playing congas is also very athletic. Are you uh, next to just practicing, also doing some kind of sports, preparing for? I do. I do sports to keep in shape, but uh, of course, the, the the best sport, the the best you can do to be in shape playing congas is to play the congas. You know. Yeah in an athletic way. <laughs> when I say athletic way, you know, it's the same way that the, the, if you are going to run 100 meters, you need to, to use some speed in short uh, distances. And this is kind of the same, the same way you, you start playing slow for a little while, some movements, and then try to play them fast in shorter periods, you know. So this is kind of, that could be a good advice. Yeah. Are you using Mac or PC? I use Mac. <laughs> Mac. Do you use iPhone? Do you have some? I don't use iPhone. Recommendations for application apps concerning percussion or congas? Um, not really. Okay. I'm not. I, do, I don't use it much for 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 the congas. I I could use, for example, I have done like like to have Logic and try to create like a minus one mm -hmm. kind of track. For, to, to practice the congas and stuff like that, but I'm not much into uh, mm -hmm. that type of technique. I would prefer to use a, a normal uh, type of uh, metronome or something like that. And can you recommend us a book you teach, you think it's the best, or you teach without? A good book is uh, The History of uh, Songo by Changuito Quintana. That's a very good book. Mm -hmm. uh, There's also a video. That this yeah. that is also be a very good one. Okay, cool. It's important to check it because it, it songo music is like one of the strong uh, roots of our of our Cuban music. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you for the interview. My pleasure. Great. Thank you for the invitation and thanks for having me here. It has yeah. been a great honor to be here. Yeah. <laughs>